I'm Lieutenant Colonel Derek Hotchkiss. I'm the acting battalion commander for the two of the 218th Field Artillery Battalion. So the two of the 218th Field Artillery is the direct support uh, artillery battalion to the 41st Infantry Brigade Combat Team. Uh, we provide the maneuver forces, uh, the infantry companies, and the CAV squadron with indirect fire support, uh, meaning we can uh, support them with long range fires. Uh, we're comprised of a headquarters battery, a detachment of forward observers who actually observe the targets. Uh, we have two light batteries, 105 millimeter howitzers, one uh, medium battery, 155 millimeter howitzers, and then our service battery, our mechanics and our supporters. Training value has been excellent. Uh, our observer coach trainers out here that are assigned to each battery, uh, active duty soldiers that are experts in their profession, so we're learning from the best. We're learning a lot about ourselves. Uh, soldiers are showing uh, some impressive re resiliency. Uh, the terrain and the weather has been unforgiving. It's hot, it's humid and uh, we're asking them to do a lot, uh, but rest assured for the family and friends out there, we're taking good care of them. They're getting good training and uh, getting to exercise those skills. And the nice thing about this is they're every day, you know, in a drill weekend, we can only do so much, but we're really able to build on our previous day's efforts and kind of keep that ball rolling uh, to make sure we're as trained as possible and taking full uh, advantage of this opportunity here at JRTC. A great opportunity here to build our teams at each level uh, as the battalion will transition after this major training event uh, to focus on an overseas deployment. Being able to witness the team out here under challenging circumstances for the last week, seeing the team come together and people learn uh, and find creative solutions, I have full confidence that uh, the team's going to be ready to take on this next, next mission set and this JRTC training event is going to help them do that.